Yeah, no, exactly. Oh, no, you're fine. Shut the fuck up. And pointing the camera. The point camera is pointing this way. The back of the camera is facing me. Don't don't record me, please. Fucking buffer, my guys. I need to. Hey, hey, I need to hit people, okay? <laughs> you <laughs> you can make it. Yeah, there's the one thing that needs You will eventually, don't worry. We yeah. all wanna, sometimes we all wanna smack weeaboos with sticks, but you know what? It relieves Yeah, so the much, time will come. It relieves so much stress, it's one of the few things I'm good at. <laughs> oh, that's a jank ass son up there. Hey, it's a. It is, it's just jank. Crazy taxi. I'm standing, driving. Yeah, the pose on that. You're gonna get crazy in that taxi, right? Despite Franny ignoring what is the greatest crazy taxi joke of all time, we did step into the land room, which is actually not that bad compared to what I've seen, especially because they have a VR setup, like two Vives, which isn't something I've seen at any convention I've been to, at least especially in the Midwest here. But this game room isn't the best. It has really cool things about it, but the biggest thing that it has to offer is just a huge amount of classic consoles to exist. I mean, just tons of ones that you wouldn't think to be at a small con and this has a lot of cool things to it which is more than I could say for some other game rooms in the Midwest here. A true professional is marked by their knowledge of their equipment so not noticing for a number of shots that the bright green light that tells that the camera microphone is on is in fact not on is a true mark of somebody who is professional. That said a true professional also can take the jokes that they make uh, that are muted and just say them in a voice line. Like here for example, how I'm here with my queen. Slay, bitch. Oh, and I guess now I just, you know, uh, here's Franny. Please, please do something funny. I, I don't, I don't know what joke to make here. Can, come on, no, oh, no. Ugh, that, <laughs> you're so embarrassing. As he lays on the ground, looking for the perfect shot. Crawls closer, looking for that wonderful ghost over there. The attempt at the perfect photo cannot be recommended. As he is the photographer. Always watching, judging, judging, always watching. Fear the Pikachu. <laughs> On our way to get Nick the lonely chairs. You know what we'll also do? You should also do? What? Put your stuff, put your sweatshirt in the room. Yeah, please. What's it called, Tom? What is this is the second person I've had like ask a bitch about the or like talk about the fucking camera. It's not pointing in the direction. Hey, there it is. Sweet. It looks like it does gonna, exist. It looks like we're gonna get shot. It's fine. Whoa. Hey, we start walking. You just see the car just get to the side. Then you can play the initial D song. <laughs> Same. <laughs> I almost got hit because I didn't wait. That's <laughs> elementary traffic, my boy. Just not this one. And to be fair, I didn't know I was getting an answer to the computer kind of there. Oh yeah. You know, it's the Francisco one with what? Fuck <laughs> All right, it's not automatic. Good to know. Oh, yeah, you want to go in the capsule seat? <laughs> I gotta show you that. We're I gotta... from the future! <laughs> I got. Women this way. 
We're <laughs> all women come this way. We're going to the right place. No. Dance game. <laughs> yeah, no, actually, you want to know what that guy did earlier? Me and Franny came up here and we're like, he was like, Shh. we have a dance game. We have fighting games. <laughs> like that inflection, he talks like that. See? All right, hold on, I'm gonna get, I gotta get up close and personal here for a moment. Doing the Casey Neistat? Yeah, dude. Yeah, what's up guys? I'm Casey Neistat. <laughs> no, we fucking, okay, so you, oh God, the glare. You'll see it in the video before this shot. This, this kid is sick and Dean, he, <laughs> he kind of struggled to get through the whole song. But it's better than I can do, and that's what matters. He's a fucking legend. He's he the is, next Chris yeah. for life. Yeah. I said later. Tomorrow? Because there's nothing here. Yeah. And it, I'm not vlogging, so. Yeah, I was gonna say, when you vlog, it's about you. Deja vu. I've just been in this place before. Higher on the street, and I know it's my time to go. Going you and the search is amazing. So it's been a while since I checked in here. Yep. I zoomed, I moved my arm in immediately after zooming and focusing in here. So we've, we've, we have game room, he has Bofford. How was that? That was interesting. I only got hit. I didn't get hit in the nuts this time. I took, <laughs> or the face. Day. Or the face. Yeah, oh no, the face, yeah. The okay. back of the head mostly. Yeah, well I'm the one that made you bleed from it. Oh yeah, I remember that. The first time I ever Bofford. You hit me in the mouth. Here at Katsune Con. Good memories. Yeah. But, uh, so yeah, we, um, I never realized that there was only four panel rooms here. Um, and that really actually isn't different from the last time. I'm just so used to being at cons that have a number, a significant number. And it's not like all the panel rooms are, like, also viewing rooms. Like, no, there's, f there's just four panel rooms. And then there's four viewing rooms. The dildos, boys. Is it Geekcon in here or is it Kitsunecon? You know, I don't even know. Hey. How do you feel about Fire Alarm? What? <laughs> how do you. How do you feel? I don't know. What's going on over there? It's some wild shit happening there. I'd be, that's the be me. That dude is me <laughs> turning the fuck around. Nope. I, I... So, one fun rude awakening from a fire alarm later. Might as well use this fire alarm time just to head right over to the convention center, huh? Sounds good to me. Look at him go. He's getting those vlog shots right there. He's doing it. Casey Neistat. Oh yeah, and the fire department's here. There's the other one. What's up? What's up, dude? What's <laughs> up, dude? <laughs> Work that tongue, boy. Video, video flash from video sub Oh, it's a live stream. Is your microphone on? It is. Okay, just make sure. I can hear everything you say. I went for the titty. <laughs> so, so far, day two is a little more lit. Um, but to be fair, Friday, this is very much a, like, in terms of Friday, and like, this con technically starts at four. A lot of other cons start at like nine or eleven. So okay, I was just I was finally talking about the convention in my vlog like I'm supposed to. So you know that thing I'm supposed to do. I had some guy outside that was vaping, talking to me about how I shouldn't get the new DSLR. With the, like which new one? Like the G7? I don't know. I don't know. She just said new DSLR. Yeah. <laughs> So oh, like and general. Then his, and then his uh and then his badge flipped around and on the other side of his Kitsune Khan badge he had a he had a pony con badge. Uh, 
that's some interesting. That's a. Uh, <laughs> You do kind of actually, you do look, oh, it's a little out of focus there, but there you go. Yeah, you got a, you got that buff look to you right now. I'm I will gonna, say this, this, look at this fucking. Is that the, is that from the dog or? Is that a muscle for tear from the dog or is that? That's just my fucking swole ass. Swole ass? Speaking of swole, 